This week on Ham Radio Adventure Guy, your one stop for everything adventure radio. What's up, Ham Radio? Kilo Echo 8, Papa Zoo in November, the Ham Radio Adventure Guy. Thanks for stopping by your one stop for everything Adventure Radio. Today, we're going to try out the Alpha Delta monoband antenna. Uh, we got a 20 meter uh, dipole here, and uh, I believe we're going to set it up as a 20 meter inverted V. So uh, let's get this thing set up and see what it'll do. All right, of course, this is just a temporary setup to test it out and yes I know it's being pulled to one side a little bit but like I said it's just a temporary setup and we're going to give it a try we're in the house and I wanted to give you guys a little look at uh, what the SWR looks like no adjustments made just set up and uh, ready to go And it looks like we've got a pretty good SWR, so let's give it a try. Anyone else before I get over the lift here, I need to get off the lift here. Any other technicians before you have a 10 minutes left, is it? Kilo Echo 8, Papa Zulu November. Uh, the, uh, 59 is in the Zulu November, so we just take the last two letters. You don't need to get your ear out there. So what's that? You're on the lift here. Uh, Kilo Echo 8. So... This is a couple of guys uh, sitting here talking on 20. Uh, we're sort of testing the antenna, seeing how to do. It's got a, got a really good receive on it. Uh, so uh, seems to be working really well. Let's see if we can get them to break and uh, maybe get a signal report from them. No, we're flying into that. Oh, yeah. I know the feeling. You mentioned that you get contracts uh, during the winter. What, what type of work do you normally do? Can I get a radio check, guys? QSL, this is a Kilo Echo 8 Papa Zulu November. I was just testing an antenna I threw up and uh, just seeing how it was doing. I'm from uh, Whiskey Victor. Okay, uh, got you, Kilo Echo 8, Papa Zulu November. Yeah, about 5 and 2, 5 and 2 here in Quebec, and uh, I'm not sure where you are. Uh, uh, what, what state are you in, over? West Virginia. Okay, maybe get uh, a report from Florida to hear that. Uh, much guys I just really needed to get a check and I, I appreciate it uh, I don't want to interrupt y'all's conversation you guys have a great evening and uh, I'll be clear uh, thank you this is K8BZM 73 okay 73 you went up to 5 and 5 I changed that tennis a little bit so. alright so I got the radio turned down I just wanted to uh, show you guys uh, you know across the band sort of where everything is uh, here's the beginning of 20 meters, uh, a little under 1.5, we'll scroll up, there's, there's in the, four, the beginning of the 14100, really good there, A 
really good there. Let's go all the way to the top and see what we got. Oh my goodness. Not even registering at the top. That's beautiful. All right, so uh, that's about it for the Alpha Delta antenna. I've used this, used it for over a week now um, on and off. Uh, I have taken, out, taken it out to parks and did some park activations with it on 20 meters. And then I've had it here set up at the house and I'll hunt with it and just get on air and see what's doing and it's doing really really well um west virginia doesn't get very great uh propagation on 20 meters because of the mountains and uh the way the way to bounce is but it does really well here i'm really impressed with it i've got a lot of dx with it so overall it's it's a pretty good antenna and you know if you if you need you a, a 20 meter dipole antenna i'd suggest it uh it, it works really well so Again, there's the top of the package. In case you guys want to see exactly what it was, it was the Alpha Delta monoband antenna in 20 meters. Uh, they do make this for other bands, and then they do make a, a long wire for multiple bands. So if you want to check it out, check it out. If you like this video from Ham Radio Venture Guy, click up here in the corner and watch another one. And while you're at it, click down here in the corner and subscribe. Make sure and follow us on all social media sites. And as always, thanks for sharing my adventure with me.